Hey subbies, welcome to stream. Uh, I hope that you're all doing well this uh, this evening. Um, it is Thursday now, which means uh, we got some stuff to talk about because it'll be Friday soon. Um, so first of all, hi Riku, welcome, and thank you so much for lurking. Hello Nathan, welcome, I am good, how are you? And hello Prime, piss, tit, and you guessed it, wiener. Same to you. Um, okay, so we got some stuff that's happening this weekend that I want to go over. Um, first and foremost is tomorrow is Friday, um, which will be our first uh, Fetish Friday since uh, the return of Fetish Friday. Fetish Friday is coming back. Um, that's going to be on joystick.tv slash u slash Wolf. Um, I hope that you guys come out and spend time with Chica and I. We're going to be playing Lust for Darkness. Um, which is a sexy and scary game that's probably going to be very cheesy and silly. Um, but it's short, so, you know, if we don't like it, then we don't have to spend too much time with it. And hey, we can take all the time we want to just snarking about on it and stuff like that. So, uh, we got that going first of all. Second of all, Saturday I'm doing a charity stream, uh, starting at 2 o'clock p.m. Eastern over on Twitch. I am going to be playing Fortnite for eight hours with um, with Natural Prime, with Sheikah Kitty, um, and possibly Melon Rose. Uh, we got some dono we got some donation goals worked out for that, uh, which I uh, I premiered earlier on my uh, Twitter. Um, but I am going to let me see if I can find them. <laughs> Ah, here they are. Uh, I will preview them now on the YouTube. Give me one second to set that up here. Just get that going. Uh, where is it? I will just... Oh, wait, that's something different. I don't know what that is. Never mind. Forget that. Um... Okay, let's see here. Do, 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 do. Let's put that on this guy. Alright. Alright, so here we have... Oh, shit. Sorry. Okay, here we have our goals. Uh, before you asked, yes, I made this myself. Um... I'm trying to do a lot more graphic designing this year. Mel usually does all of my graphic designing. Uh, I'm trying to take some of that burden off of her so that I can start doing it myself. Um, in addition to small video editing here and there, very small. I'm, I'm not. I'm not a video editor at all. Um, so, uh, the name of this event is Fortnite for Care, which you can't see because I have very silly, uh, very sillily um, disguised the title. Uh, we're doing an eight-hour Fortnite stream to raise money for Ukraine in partnership with Soft Giving and Care. And these are all of our donation goals. Uh, we're trying to go up to $400. The Soft Giving meter says $500 because it doesn't let me take it less, uh, less than $500. So after $400, we are going to be just raising money. There won't be any goals after that, but you guys can still donate money if you want to. Um, alright, so $10, uh, I'm going to call you a good subby, that means I'm just going to praise people in chat. Um, $25, you guys write a tweet, and then every $25 thereafter, you guys get to write another tweet. Uh, $50, uh, Juan for one hour. $100, I swap to my bunny costume, which is not technically Twitch appropriate, but we can still show it. Um, $150, uh, you guys get to design a new... <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> A new emote for me. Uh, $175, I drink cock. Tail. It's a coke mocktail. I'll mix it with uh, kombucha and some coke. Uh, $200, uh, you guys help me make a skeb request. I'm going to put up a poll for that and we'll decide what we want to request. And then I will uh, help, uh, I will ask um, Ebby to help me find an artist for it. Uh, $250, I'm going to do a fake mon drawing stream from memory. I already can't name Pokemon, so uh, it stands to reason I won't be able to draw them either. Uh, $275, this is the one I'm most excited about, aside from the merch kickoff, is I'm going to do a not safe for work writing gotcha stream. What that means is that you guys are going to pick an outfit that you like most on Dom, 
and I am going to write something uh, sexy with it um, on stream. Uh, that will involve a couple of wheels that I am going to put words on, and then we're going to spin the wheels, and we're going to take three words from the wheels, and we are going to write something with them. And then, if we get to $300, you guys get to uh, help me build an OC for this writing, uh, writing stream to feature in the piece. We're going to do one of those OC building prompts for that. Uh, this is going to be a separate stream as well as the fake mon stream, but I am going to plan them within this month if I can. Um, if I can't, then I will plan them within uh, the coming weeks. And last of all, I am threatening you with a small merch kickoff. Um, if we get to this goal, what we're going to do is uh, Mel is going to design a little guy and I'm going to release it on one of those um, one of those websites, like uh, maybe not Redbubble, but something similar to Redbubble, uh, where you guys can purchase stickers and stuff like that, if you're interested, um, of me. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Uh, special thanks to Prime and, uh, and Mel for helping me come up with those, and for Ebby and, uh, and Rory for suggesting the fake mon and the... Uh, and the one one um redeems all right that is what we're doing on saturday and now on sunday sunday we have uh dog boy sunday we're gonna continue playing ori uh with turtle and uh, i'm gonna be in the red donnie model for that which you guys really seem to like i'm glad that you all really like that so that's what's happening on Sunday. So we got quite an exciting weekend plan. There's something going on almost every day this weekend. Um, I hope you guys are excited for that. Today, however, we are going to continue Chained Echoes, which is the little JRPG that we were playing last week. Um, last week we got to the mountains, and I don't know what that means because I didn't get to go much further than getting to the mountains. So we're gonna see what it means together. Alrighty, let's go ahead and do the thing. Hold on. Let me hide this silly guy. And this silly guy. And change from this guy. Hold on a sec. There we go. That's better. Uh, and let me hide all these guys. These guys are not important for... For... YouTube. Okay. Probably can hide all those guys too, but... Oh, no. All right, well, we can't play Chain Echoes. All right, well, that sucks a lot. Uh, okay, so we can't play Chain Echoes because Mel is, uh, <laughs> Mel is, uh, got her game open. Um, and as you know, Steam cannot allow two people can play a thing at the same time. So, while Mel has her game open, I am not allowed to play it. So. Uh, alright. That was not what I expected to happen, but that's okay. Um, instead, I guess we're going to play our not-so-regularly-scheduled Dead Cells. Um, until we can play, yeah, but it won't carry over. I'd have to start all over. That wouldn't, that wouldn't work. The save pile is not compatible across, uh, across Steam and Game Pass. Unless it is. It's not, though. They're two different platforms. Cool. 
So we will just uh, we will just do our reg not so regularly scheduled dead cells. It's fine. It's fine. Ignore that. Ignore that. That's that's just uh, that's just regularly scheduled anger from the PS5. Oh Jesus! Hold on. I gotta situate this. I gotta. I gotta situate this situation real quick. <laughs> Capture cards are stupid. Good God. What the hell's all this? Sorry, we will be ready in a moment. I just gotta. I just gotta fix some guys real quick. Let me see here. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think it was fixed. Let me see. Try that again. Just gotta fix the sound. Oh, it's doing that thing where it's not fixing. Jesus. Hold on a sec. <coughs> Might take a minute to fix this. Oh, wait. Hold on. No. Nah, it's just being weird. Well, I hope all of you are good today. Um, while I do this. Everyone's had a nice Thursday. Okay, it's fixed. Alright, let's go on the dead cells. Oh no, the controller's dead. <coughs> dead game, dead controller. Where does it end? I've been like raw dogging learning how to crochet. I saw, I was following your crochet exploits all day. Uh, that's silly. I was following your crochet exploits when you had them on Twitter. Which is not all day. It was whenever you posted on them, which was twice today. That's that's more truthful. However, I was reading about it from you, and I'm sorry to hear that it did not go well. Well, I think it's probably one of those things where like practice makes perfect, so you just gotta keep practicing and I'm sure you'll I'm sure you'll get better at it. But um not good that it hurt your hands though. That's not great. <coughs> I'm sorry that happened. Are you going to keep trying? Or is it one of those things where, like, you tried it and it's just not for you? It's not going too poorly. I'm just not perfect yet. Yeah. I have a bad habit of bailing on things if I'm not amazing right off the bat. Honestly, same. I think most people do. I bail on most new things if I'm not very good at them right off the bat. Like, that's kind of how I just sort of stopped messing with video editing. I tried it a couple of times, realized I wasn't good at it, realized I didn't really have the time to be good at it, 
And then I just stopped messing with it. But I hope that I hope that you keep with it, and I hope that it gets better. I'm still trying. It's gonna be a fun skill to have. Well, oh, good. I'm glad. God, when I was skiing the first time, I had a giant meltdown because I ate shit on the bunny hill. Oh no! Skiing sounds really hard, though. Like from the perspective of somebody who lives in a uh, warm climate like mine. Skiing just sounds difficult. So I can't blame you for having a meltdown for that. I watched so many YouTube videos on how to ski and I thought I would at least be able to not eat shit. That's very fair. It always sucks when, like, you go into something with expectations of, like, being good at it because of, like, preparation, and then you find out that you're not. Like, that used to happen a lot to me with tests, and it fucked me up because I have, uh, I have test anxiety. So, like, whenever I would study for things and then I would do terribly at them, I would always get so upset. But there was an ass full of snow. Beanie halfway down, <laughs> across the hill, full of tears. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Sometimes, even with preparation, we're just not good at things. That's just that's just a fact of life. Like you can study things, you can. You can try your best not to be bad at something, but sometimes you're just not good at things. That's just how it goes sometimes. I try not to be too hard on myself when like I'm not good at something that I thought I'd be good at, but sometimes it's really hard to just give yourself a break, you know? Like with video editing. I've tried on many occasions to, like, do it, thinking that I'll get better at it as I do it, and then I just get discouraged because it, it always, like, it's always shit. Or, like, I don't get something. I ended up learning and having a good time, so it wasn't a total bust. I just had to humble myself. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. It's true. Being bad is the first step of being good, and if you don't want to, you don't got to take that step. Yeah. And a lot of people will give up before before that step is over just because they're afraid of being bad at something. But, like, you'll never learn how to be good at something if you're not bad at it first. Like, nobody starts off just instantly good at something. And if you do, that's an anomaly. Because that's tip that's very much not a normal experience for most people. But, I digress. I know I can think of plenty of things that I definitely did not start out good at. Like, it, it definitely took me some time to... It takes me time to learn most things, honestly. Especially new skills. Like, I'm not typically terrible at things when I'm first starting out, but I'm definitely not good at them. And there are definitely things that, like, some people take too easier than others. And yes, I'm eating egg rolls while having this conversation. Um, there's definitely things that some people take too easier than others. And then there are people who are just generally slower at things. But all of that is okay, because we all learn at our own pace. And it's not a competition. But it is sometimes hard to humble ourselves and understand that. What? Oh. Okay. Goodbye, broadsword.
I actually get like really annoyed at people who just go into things expecting to be good at them for the first time. And I really don't know why. Like, it's not a problem. It's just like, why did you expect to be good at this thing if you're new to it, you know? It defies common sense. I'm very okay with being bad now at most things. Being bad is fun when you're around people who want to empower you. Very true. Very true. For me, it's very hard to be bad at things, but I try and give myself at least a little bit of grace, so to speak, with regards to new things especially. Like growing up, it was really hard for me to be bad at stuff like school related, like classes and stuff like that. I would, it would be almost existentially crushing not to do well. But as I've gotten older, I've learned that it's okay not to be very good at something. And that the only way to get good at something is by practicing. I think having the job that I have right now kind of helped with that. But also the fact that like after losing my job from higher education and, um, and having my life more or less turned upside down was kind of humbling in a way. Because up until that point in my life, I very much knew what I wanted to do, and I had a path to do it, and it all seemed like so rudimentary and easy and simple. Like I don't, like I, there's tons of things that could have gone wrong, but it didn't feel like anything could, you know? So at the point I am in my life right now, I've come to finally understand that it's okay to be bad at things. And that, honestly, most of the time, you will be. Which is also a... Um, which is also a thing you need to practice in, uh, in BDSM. Especially as a Dom. Because there's a lot of failures before you have success at it. And a lot of hard conversations. God damn it. Oh god, yeah, schoolwork is something I'm very anxious about performing perfectly in. Same. Very much same. Um And I don't know what it is that that causes that. I mean, maybe it's the fact that like all my life I was just bad at school and like when I got into college, that was when everything just started to make sense. Like college was the first time I was a student where I actually felt like I was doing well at things. So it, it really upset me a lot when I didn't do well in classes and stuff like that. Just because that was the expectation. <laughs> so, the point of this is to say that it's okay to be bad at things. And it's okay not to get things on the first try. And people who tell you otherwise are weird. And you should treat them like they're weird. Because they're weird.
It was actually really refreshing, um, that video from the other day, the, the Twitch, the Twitch streamer video. It was actually really refreshing to see a lot of people talk about how they failed at uh, being streamers before finding some modicum of success. Or like how they had like bad setups and things like that. Because like VTubers don't talk about those things, right? Because the word failure apparently doesn't exist in the VTuber community. I don't know. It made me feel really... Uh, it made me feel a lot better. Agreed. Being bad rocks. <clears throat> they were. They were. I'm very tempted to give all of those people a follow just because they seem like good people. And I'm trying really hard this year to break away from VTuber um, circles, like, altogether. Um, because VTuber circles are bad for you. Especially as a person like me who just uh, finds toxic positivity poisonous. And also because this year I kind of want to try meeting more... Um, Face cam streamers than VTubers, because they seem they seem more down to earth. There was another panel that I can't seem to find. It was on making money on streaming. I think it was all bipoc uh, bipoc panel too. Oh, I would be interested in seeing that, but it's unfortunate if you can't find it. I probably probably has something to do with TwitchCon. I was actually surprised that that panel was allowed to be shared. <laughs> but I would be very interested in seeing that one for sure. But their insight was amazing and listening to them talk about their struggles without managing a day job. Uh, with managing a dang job. Um, streaming as well. So banging. Yeah, I'd really like to see that one. That sounds like one that would be very beneficial to me. Literally all I can find are stupid dream panels. It's like none of the other ones were uploaded. That really is a shame. There's going to be nasty people in every circle, but truly the v people, the VTuber circle just has not my kind of people in it. <clears throat> I wouldn't mind it so much if it wasn't just a community of people that pretends to be perfect, that literally are not. Like, that's what I find so off-putting about it, is the amount of people that just pretend they are absolute perfection, and no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Every VTuber is just a person using an avatar to stream. Including me. That's just how it is. There's not a single one of us that's not using an avatar. And yet it's a group of people that pretends to be so holier than thou. Usually having the worst opinions imaginable. 
And that's what I can't get over with it. I should probably uh, I should probably start a thread on Twitter or something, asking people to recommend their favorite face cam streamers. Oh no, I shouldn't because then I'll get stuff like Dream and Asmin Gold and uh, not my type of people. I'll walk that back real quick. <laughs> Oh, Mel has informed me that we can play Chained Echoes now. Nice. My problem is just that, like, I'm not good at meeting people. Like, part of the reason why I vibrate... So part of the reason why I, uh sort of orient myself so much around uh, VTubers is just because that's like easy. It's something I have in common with them. And like I have preconceived notions as well about being judged for using an avatar to stream. Which I know are just mostly stuff in my head. Like stuff that probably would never happen. Just my brain being rude. But you know. It's, it's a thing. All right, let's see. Here are my four recommendations. Wait, five. My sister, her husband, my friend from work, Jerma, and Lexi. Okay, you can drop all of those links into my DMs, and I will, I will look at them with my eyeballs. Welcome home, Mel. I hope that you had fun bowling. Thank you for letting me play the Chained Echoes. I appreciate it. Uh, we are going to do our regularly scheduled trained e uh, tr yeah, Chained Echoes now. So I'm gonna I'm gonna migrate away from dead so uh, dark souls. D God damn it, dead cells. <clears throat> All right. Uh, let's just turn off PS5. I had fun, and now my belly is full of burger and popper. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad that you enjoyed yourself. I don't remember the last time I went bowling. I think it might have been in class. I don't know. It's been a while. It's been a long time. It's just hard to meet people for me in general, which is why shit like VTuber Park has been nice. I've enjoyed VTuber Park um, a lot, but I feel like I can't connect to many people in there. Like, I feel like I'm building small connections, but I don't know. I feel pressured in Discord servers to connect to people, I guess. I've always had that problem. Because it feels like when you're not connecting to people in a Discord server, then you're just kind of there taking up space, and I don't really like that feeling. <clears throat> Before you ask, yes, Chain Echo should have music. And yes, I had it muted. Um, we have a joke now where we were talking about how war is bad, but then I saw a burger ad on TV, so I spread my arms out and went burger. Oh my. And Shay just thought it was being me. Me being me. She didn't know there was a burger on TV, so now we are going burger. <laughs> nice. Um, What the hell? Oh, wait, is it not? Oh, okay, here we go. Friends are something you build over time. A server is good for allowing that. I haven't met anyone who's super slap with me, but it's been close. It might happen. Yeah, I haven't met anyone that's slap with me either. Like, I've met a lot of people that have good opinions and, like, their head's on the right shoulder and head's in the right place, but... Well... Oh. Well. Sorry for mispronouncing it then. Wow, there's a lot of crystals everywhere here.
Like all my streamer friends I met through Mel and you. Mine I met through Mel, you, some other friends who used to stream, but I don't really talk to any, who used to be friends, but I don't really talk to anymore. And I guess Twitter. It's K Pucci. Friends are a great way to make more friends. Yeah, that's true. All right, we got Horn Lizard. We got Horn Lizard here. He's horny. Wait, what? Why is it not? Hold on. Why is the sound not working? Give me a second. Give me a second. I'm going to fix this. It was working just fine a moment ago. Are you kidding me? God damn it. Wait, okay, now it's working. What the hell? Wait, okay, now it's not working. I'm so confused. Okay, how is it not? What the hell? I swear it was just working a moment ago. Okay, hold on. Hold on. One, one second. I gotta fix my sound. God. <coughs> okay, I think it's fixed now. <coughs> yeah. Friends are a great way to make more friends. TBH, all the friends I make are people I get to know over time, so I'm not worried. <coughs> like, besides my childhood friends, my closest VTuber friend is Ebby, and that took a while. Oh, and you, but we obviously... Obviously, but we made a twerk fire. I mean, I guess you can call it that. I'm fine. <coughs> now that the sound is fi uh, fixed, I'm fine. It just needed to be fixed real quick. Mouse off the screen. <clears throat> oh? Oh, it's another dinosaur! Wait, that's not a dinosaur, that's the horny lizard. It's another horny lizard. <clears throat> Ooh, comfy scarf. Wait, what does comfy scarf do? It just says an accessory. Thank you. Um, okay. Okay, I guess we're not. I guess we're not getting descriptions for these accessories here. Oh, never mind. Okay, that's immune to silence. Uh, raises resistance to wind. <coughs> Who should be immune to silence? Probably him, since he heals some guys sometimes. <coughs> okay, that's a horny lizard. We'll avoid the horny lizard for now. Hello, merchant man. Let's see about your deals, sir. You know what? Fuck your deals, sir. I don't care about them. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god. <clears throat> Alright, we got some new deals. Oh, wow. Okay, hey, we can take... Mm, that's a lot of money. <clears throat> we will forego that for now. <clears throat> Maybe we'll come back once we have a little bit more money to get that thing. There's a river down there. Well, I guess it's flowing down there. It's not... Well, I mean, there is a river down... Never mind. Oh, hello! What the fuck? Where did you come from? Medusian Viper? Oh, my. <coughs> they just came out of nowhere. The hell? Damn. <clears throat> we should probably leave. That was a tough snake. Okay, we won't go that way. That was rough. All right. We'll go this way then. Oh, wait. Okay, we have to go to the snakes, I guess. Damn. All right. Is there no other way? That's where the horny lizard is. <laughs> Alright, I guess we have to fight the snake after all. Or wait, maybe we can sneak past it? Oh no. No, we can't. Okay. Um, Alright, let's try our best here. Let's just do what we can. I've had pictures of Boss Baby secretly open all day. Oh my. Secretly, huh? I've been ignoring my computer to do crafts, and it just popped on and bam, Boss Baby. I'm surprised it wasn't a Poe. <coughs> I too am surprised, actually. Okay. Well, I was going to say, well, at least they're not doing the hit everyone at once thing, but then he did the hit everyone at once thing, so I guess I can't say that now. Um, Thank you. 
Oh my. Hmm. Well, that's rude. It blinded all my guys. <clears throat> Damn. Damn, that sucks. Everything misses when you're blind, I guess. <clears> okay, <throat> hey, did you know that tomorrow is Friday the 13th? Will you play a scary game tomorrow? Yes or no? I'll play Subnautica. I did not know tomorrow's Friday the 13th. I that did not it, that's not something I factored into my schedule. when I made it. I guess I probably should have thought more about that one. Yay, some Nautica. Yeah, that game. I'm gonna play that. Yay, Subby is a spooky game. I'm taking my pants off for you, okay? Okay, if you want to. There are several guys that are scary in it. Oh yeah, that's very true. There are several notable guys that are scary in Subnautica. For Dami or for the snakes? Um, I would hope for me. Oh, Mooch failed at hiding, I see. But actually, it's for the burger that's inside me. I see. Well, that is a thing that you can do. That was rough with those snakes. I hope we don't have to fight those guys again. But at least we got some snake cheeks, whatever that whatever the fuck that's worth. I hope they're face cheeks and not butt cheeks. That'd be kinda weird if we just got snake butt cheeks out of nowhere. It'd be very strange. Oh shit. Oh damn. Oh no. We have a twofer. We should probably fight the vipers first. Snake butt cheeks. Yep. Snake butt cheeks. We'll see. I'm sure they're actual cheeks, but you know. You never know. These are some weird looking snakes to begin with, to BH. Like, what snakes have eyes in their cheeks? Honestly, I don't trust that. Well, that's fucking rude. I'm glad that missed. Oh no. Bye, Kenyan. Oh, Killian, rather. <clears throat> they are cheeked up. You are sure right about that.
the fuck? Why did they just gang up on him? What was the point in that? Why would you do that? That was so rude. Alright, you know what? Fuck you guys. <clears throat> Y'all have made all of the wrong moves at all of the wrong times. Oh no, we're in overheat. Not anymore, we're not. Bam. Nice. Fuck you. Yay! Now all the guys are paralyzed. Oh no! Oh good, that missed. Whew. Oh my! That's rude. Yay, that snake is dead. Fuck him. He's a piece of shit. He's a real piece of shit, that snake. <laughs> Alright, now the dinos are dead, too. Lizards. Whatever they are. I don't know. Lizard dinos. Lizard oars. Lizard nose. Dino lizards. Something like that. One of those things is right. <clears throat> hey, we found buried treasure. Ooh. That's a nice one. The Wakazishi. Alright, that's the wrong way, apparently. We're not going to go that way, because it's the wrong way. <clears throat> okay, that's the wrong way, apparently. I'm glad that the game tells us which way is wrong. Oh no, I ran into dinos! Well, that's rude. At least it left him at 5 HP. It could have been worse, I suppose. Could have left him at 0 HP. Alright, his job is done.
Oh no! We're in bad territory. Oh shit. We might get a game over here. <clears throat> Goodbye, Rob. Lucky hit, you bastard. This has gone awry. We had a plan for these dinos and that plan failed. They were perhaps a little too cheeked up, those dinos. Alright, okay. Let's try this again. We're not gonna switch at the start of the battle this time like a bunch of dumbasses. That was perhaps not a good choice. Immediately, they were just like, fuck her, I guess. They really did not like her. That Len person. Fuck her in particular, I suppose. Alright, well, there's one dino dead. I'm still here. I'm just working on my boss baby business. Oh, you're fine. I'm still here dying. So. That makes two of us still here, I think. The dinos have been bested. 
They will think twice about fucking with me again. Probably. Probably not, actually. Why is there a vulture there? Just in that tree there. Just right there. Can't get up to that vulture. I don't know what that vulture is all about. Oh, there's a lot of birds and trees and stuff. <coughs> oh, there's a nice bridge here. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh no! It's the guys. It's the team of nefarious men. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's I don't think that's how that's gonna work. Oh my! Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot. This game has text boxes. Let me real quickly. Oh no, it's Math Yi! <clears throat> it is indeed rare to meet lost princesses in the middle of the wild. Uh oh. Oh my. Oh. Wow. That's you're just coming out in the open with that. Oh my. The rudeness. Useless are we? I just dispatched a team of very, very precariously poised dinos. Oh my. I guess he's just determined to start his war, regardless of what stories we have. Uh. Oh, okay. So that is what I thought that is. He is going to make them kill the princess. That's... Alright then. Okay, wait, who's Felix? Oh my god! Oh! Uh... Oh! It's a guy! happening here <clears throat> okay I guess we're fighting this guy I don't know who this dude is am I supposed to know this dude okay well he's weak to water because he's in a machine so I mean I guess there's that
<clears throat> Strong laser. What a name for an attack. This is probably not going to work on a machine, but... Oh, it did. Nice. Okay. Look, rude ass. Uh, I don't know what to do from here. Mm, no, that won't do anything. Bam. Alright, that guy's gonna have to defend. Oh no, not strong laser! Damn, strong laser really is strong. What the fuck? They aren't kidding. Let's build a machine man. That was a nice machine man we built. Counter stance? What the hell is that shit? I don't want to find out. Is it for one turn? It's for one turn, right? Yeah. I don't wish to find out what that is. <clears throat> well, I could probably cleanse that, maybe. Maybe I'll try it next time. Okay, his counter stance is gone. Fuck him up! Give him the old one, two. Oh no! We got strong lasered again!
shield up? Oh, defense buff, I see. Well, we can negate that quite easily. Hey, nice, paralyze. <coughs> no, he's paralyzed, so he's not gonna do much. He's still paralyzed, nice. Another robot for you, sir. Two can play at the robot game. I also have a robot. Oh no, not strong laser again. <clears throat> oh, counter stance. Damn, didn't work. Flash. Oh, it only worked on one person. I hope you know what you're doing, Glenn. Not using that heal might prove to be very bad for someone. Oh, we'll have to do an ultra move soon. Oh, we won. Nice. I don't know what's happening to him, but he's... Blowing up, or something. He is going to explode. Oh my! He blew up the bridge, probably. Oh, he certainly did. And he left Rob behind. How rude. Rob, are you gonna jump in there? Oh, yep, there he goes. Well, there goes the bridge. I hope nothing important was on that bridge. Oh, hello. Whose fate do you wish to follow? Oh, we get to choose something. Hmm. Okay. Um. I like Sienna. She's my favorite. So let's do Sienna.
I thought we were... I thought we'd fallen off the bridge. I guess we're traveling with uh, with Sienna now. All right, I guess we're not going there. There's some dinos over there. Some very evil dinos. If I do say so myself. have three evil dinos just sitting there waiting to be awoken oh there's a chest down there hmm I bet that buried treasure is near those dinos mm, no we probably can't take those by ourselves I would be quite surprised if we could all right let's learn some skills though Let's learn... let's learn attack two. Oh, we get more skills to learn! Hmm, yeah, that buried treasure is probably next to those dinos. We will have to remember to come back to those dinos once we have the team back together. Nice. <coughs> hey, nice. We got some money. Hey, it's that guy. Damn it. Freaking keyboard. I'm not even fucking bastard. I guess we must be sneaky again. Oh, let's talk to this guy. They live off of what the mountain gives them. But what if the mountain gives them nothing? Then I guess they live off of nothing? I do have nothing to do here. He is right. 
I'm glad that he recognized that instead of just letting me waltz in like the other guys do. Hello there. Wow. Okay. So they hate strangers. They're rude to people that have nothing to do. What a rude little town. Rock bottom can suck my cock. Hello there. Jesus! I mean... Sure. Wow, okay, so even if we obey them, we're still called stupid? There's nothing good about this town. Oh, well, we seem to have made our way into the mines. Oh, jute fiber. That makes good shibari rope. <clears throat> wow. This is just an unpleasant town all around. Everything about this place is just unpleasant. I will steal that key with pleasure. After work, Coco. That's the first unpleasant thing. That's the first not not pleasant thing I've heard in this town all day. I hope he enjoys his after work, Coco. I hope he enjoys it for both of us. What the hell? Ovens? They encounter ovens? We're gonna fight ovens? Indeed, there has been nothing here to see in Rock Bottom. You are not wrong. Nothing but rudeness, that is. There's plenty of rudeness, not much else. Just a lot of rudeness. We don't have any of that, so we'll just work with the Wakazishi right now. fibers I see what's all this then looks like some kind of shitty shop oh that's not a shitty shop at all who's that little guy on the right that little funny looking frog man oh my that's like a slime dude oh that is a funny looking frog man A new guy. <clears throat> this looks like Robotnik Orgy. Oh, I hate that. 
He is well known among mercenaries, a Lisbon who speaks of himself in the plural and wears meadow prothesis for meadow arms and legs, which he moves by magic. There are rumors that he received this skill in return for the pact. Since then, as part of the curse, he can summon magical weapons in battle and bend metal to his will. Oh, he's a metal bender. Wow, okay. Oh my god! Honestly, same though. I wish they would all drop dead too. This town is awful. That guy is just taking a piss. That guy is literally just pissing all over the fucking place. What the hell? What is up with this town? Look at this man, he's just taking a piss! Yeah, clearly you're taking a piss here. I see that. Thank you for that eruditious knowledge. I don't think eruditious is a word, but you know what? That's... <coughs> he can fuck my foot. All right, well, we will have to find another way to do the thing. Perhaps we can go back to that lady who asked us to deliver the lunchbox and demand reward or threaten it out of her, perhaps. Probably threaten it out of her since everyone here is damn unpleasant. Now you listen here, madam. Wait, what? But I... I... But... Didn't I... Didn't we do that? Did we give it to the wrong guy? The hell? They let us do it twice? Oh my. Oh no, that's, that's, that, that is not, um, that's not the spelling I had in mind for that word. <clears throat> hmm. I suppose perhaps we shall need to make ourselves presented. All right, let us present ourselves. Oh, never mind. Oh, I didn't ex search this place yet. Hello, my friend. What are you doing? Well, I suppose that's where it gets its name. That man's just asleep on the job. Some upstanding citizens in this rock bottom. I suppose we may as well. Whoa! There's so many things. All right, I suppose we can use this to pay off our friend. Furby like me? What? I'm not a Furby.
Okay, so he won't touch the soldiers. Clothing store? Perhaps the clothing store is this man's shop. No, he likes you. Oh, well, that's kind of him. Oh, I see. So we're going to burgle. Oh, wow. That's very different from burgling. Oh, my. You love Lizard? The Lizard? Okay, we seem to be outside again. Past that terrible town of Rock Bottom. <coughs> that horrid little town. Oh my! Oh my! Oh, it's a little crow! Its name is Mountain BB? The egg orb is bursting! Uh, what? I hate that. Yeah, his name is Mountain BB. Goodbye, Mountain BB. We took his hat. We killed him and took his hat. How rude of us. What has the world come to where we just kill where birds and take their hats? Oh no, it's another Mountain BB.
Goodbye, Mountain BB. Hmm. Uh-oh. It's Slime Boy and Frog Boy. Oh, and it's that man. Largry? Which one is Largry? Is that the frog? Oh! Goodbye, Largry's hand. It's been cut off. Okay, we need to fight Osric now. Oh, indeed. Indeed. Let's fight the Jello. Why not? Why not? Jesus. This man is relentless in using double attacks. Counter stance, huh? Well, we're going to have to test that. Goodbye, pudding. Damn! Oh! Both of them lost hands now. Well, that's fine. I mean, they're two. They're two mercenaries. I mean, they're two. They're two guys. So I mean, if they team up together, each of them has one hand. So they will have two hands that way. <clears throat> oh. 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 Well, our friend has left us. High and dry. 
Oh, never mind. There's more. Uh, let's go with... Let's go with Glenn and Lynn. They rhyme, so, you know. Ah, they're in the river. I knew someone would be. All right, so let's learn some skills. Oh my, Minu's a monorail. Indeed you did. He's smacking his lips like a freak. I can't believe my eyes. Indeed. He's being quite the monorail in that photograph. I heard him and turned around and this was the mode. He's always got some kind of mode going on, that one. Very strange cat, Minu is. How come we just keep picking up rats off the ground? Oh no, it's a... What is that? Waterfly? Oh my. Nice. You can fuck off kindly, Waterfly. I don't even know who you are or what you wanted. But I assure you, you can fuck off kindly. Oh no, he's back! For vengeance! How dare he return? You're the worst person in this game so far. You're not even a person, you're a fly. I assure you, however, you are certainly the worst. Goodbye, Waterfly. 
We shall not meet again. Not like that. At least I hope not. Aha! I see. That was a trap. I won't fall for that one again. What the hell is that lizard doing? Oh my. They got the sky armors out looking for us. Oh my. They're rounding them up. They're rounding up some dudes. <laughs> oh. Oh. Seems it's sundown now.
Oh my. <laughs> oh my. Well, that's quite something that Oh my. Jesus. What is that door thing? Oh my, well that is, that's news, not good news, um, oh my, <sighs> alright, let's, let's continue this for now. <laughs> All right. Uh Well, it would seem that the co-creator of Rick and Morty and the creator of High on Life has been charged with felony domestic violence. And I just put up my YouTube video of High on Life before going on this stream. So it's rather bad timing for me if I if I say so myself. But I guess I would have had no way to know that before the stream. Indeed. Oh dear is is right. I think I'll be uh taking that off my schedule. Put a new game in its place. We'll worry about that after the stream. Uh let's go ahead and continue this for a bit longer now. Yeah. <laughs> this is no fairy tale. 
I mean, that was a fairy, though, or something like a fairy. Hmm. So how are we gonna... Oh, okay. Oh. Well, that is similar to a fairy. Or some kind of light. If not a fairy's light, then it's certainly weird. Maybe like a spotlight? Yeah, Justin Roiland. That man. I wish I could say I'm surprised by these allegations, but I'm really not. I mean, I understand that the medium, sorry, the media that someone produces uh, may not necessarily reflect everything about them, but it is kind of telling how violent a show uh, Rick and Morty was for, uh, and just everything related to the, that person, just everything is just so violent. So I guess I'm not surprised to see that uh, he has been convicted for domestic violence in addition to that. I'm, however, very, very disappointed. Um, even if I'm not surprised, I'm not downplaying the conviction. It's it's very disappointing. He's a piece of shit. Um, and... Okay. I guess we're not going any further. Eh? Oh? Oh my! What the hell is that? I'm only surprised because there are some decent people who have been friends with him, so I'm wondering how this is affecting them right now. Oh, no doubt. No doubt. Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh, cool. Okay. So we got some we got some new mechanics here. All right, we must fight the forgotten boar now. He's countering physical attacks. So we're going to use some elemental Oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. Fuck. Well, that was a mistake. Me and my lust for attack power. Oh god, he ice aged me. Damn, he counters physical attacks every time. That's rough. I retweeted the article if you want to read it, by the way, Mel. I haven't read it myself just because I've been streaming, but Prime shared it with me. All 
All right, let's see here. Oh, you're reading it, okay. Oh, Jesus. Nice. Fuck that boar. Goodbye, boar. Oh, he exploded. Well, there shall be no quarter for him. He has been defeated. Oh, my. Oh, lovely. He released an NFT art collection with over a dozen works in 2021 which sold for over 1.65 million. He released another NFT project in 2022. Oh my. What? What the fuck? What the fuck? The world wants us dead? That's wild as hell. Alright, so I guess we're following these guys now. Well, the man's just a piece of shit all around, I guess. Dabbling in NFTs, committing domestic violence. Just all around dumpster man. This has been an ongoing case from 2020, and the person that he did it to is remaining anonymous and filed a restraining order, so I'm taking it 100% serious. Oh, absolutely. That doesn't sound like something to joke around with at all. Yeah. Sounds like it.
I wonder if I should take down my video now. It sucks because it just finished uploading like right as I was streaming this as I was streaming on this stream. God, people are so, people are just awful. Yeah, I'll deal with it later. Alright, well, we did a lot of, uh, we did a lot of sculpting there, so we should be more than ready to take on whatever challenge these guys have to deal with. Oh, it looks like they're going through the Wigrin Mines. So they're the ones that are going to have to deal with the oven monsters, I suppose. I can't wait to run into an oven monster. Oh no, the oven monsters. Oh my god, they have oven mitts on? Oh, I love that. hard these ovens. Flesh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. They killed Victor. How dare they? How dare they kill Victor? Victor did nothing wrong. Victor was just a guy. Jesus Christ, are you kidding? You guys killed Rob and Victor? Oh my god. Well, this is just fucked. Critical release and new critical sings? What? Really? That's wild. I didn't know that. I did not know he sings. Fuck these ovens. They're sacks of shit. Oh, is he now? That's really interesting. I can't say I ever would have expected that.
Jesus. Damn it. It's going to happen the same way it did last time. What the fuck? Well, that sucks. Total waste of an ultra move, that's for sure. All right, well, goodbye, I guess. Jesus, what the hell? All right, well, that's not the way, I suppose. That's a bunch of bullshit. Oh my. I guess we'll just try our best to, I don't know. Just try our best. That's just all we can do. Just try our best. with these stupid ass ovens I regret everything I regret ever saying anything about wanting to meet these ovens this sucks everything about this is garbage fuck this this is stupid good god fuck this I think not. How about you fuck off? Jesus Christ. The hell was all that bullshit about? Fuck! I didn't mean to do that. No, I need to not... Oh, fuck. Okay, I guess we can't avoid them. How the fuck am I supposed to beat these things? Jesus, I don't know what to do. all this I don't know what that did something
Christ, what the fuck? Alright, well, I guess we lost again. The fuck? How the hell are we supposed to beat these stupid fucking oven things? What the hell? Jesus Christ. Hit Kinian, please. Oh, of course you would use that. Oh my god. At least one's dead. Ah, of course, but he gets to attack twice because, I don't know, fuck me, I guess. Jesus, what the hell? How am I supposed to get past these things? I only have three guys. What the fuck? Fuck it, I'm taking it off of him. I don't I don't know what else I can do. This is just stupid. This is dumb levels of stupid. Fuck you, you dumb oven son of a bitches. God, that was stupid. Okay, I guess... I guess we really needed to take that off of him, I suppose.
Oh, Jesus. Oh, my. Gazer? Shit. Everyone's poison. Fuck.
Nice. Fuck Gazer. Bastard. He was a fucker. That Gazer. Oh fuck, it's the ovens again. Goodbye, Evan. Fuck you, oven. Why has he got such a hard cock? That was not cool of him to do. Nice. Fuck him. Fuck him and his hard cock.
Ah, uh, that was certainly a gigantic worm. Megalo worm? Oh my. Oh no, he's back, and his hard cock is too. <laughs> if only. Goodbye, sir. Take you and your hard cock and get the fuck out. Who's that little man? Oh, my. Um. Okay. I don't know what any of that means. Oh, damn, this is a lot harder. Okay, hold on. Hmm. Yeah, this is about to be a rough time. Okay. Alrighty, alrighty, okay. Um. Giga Dill Drill Breaker. I was about to say Giga Dill Breaker, but that would have been weird. Which has been staring at the water fountain. He is making up his mind. There's a lot to consider. He screams at me, and then he keeps staring. He's obsessed. He's trying to understand how the water goes. He doesn't get it. He's confused. <sighs> Dildo breaker indeed. Man's definitely a dildo breaker. I'm sure he's broken quite a few dildos in his time.
This is the job for this. Wow, that's rude. See you in hell, Dill Pickle Man. Shit, he's still here. See you in hell, deal breaker man.
Goodbye, Giga Drill Man. He had his ass beaten. He's a real son of a bitch and he's dead because of it. Hey, we can learn new skills. Nice. Okay, let's see. All right, we got dry for two turns. HP regen, defensive buff. HP absorb shield. Ooh. Let's do that one. I completely forgot that we have maps in this game. Until that dungeon. He was there all this time! How wild! What a freak! What a little freak! Ooh, shielded mail! Oh no! The birds with hats! It's the BBs! Perhaps he wants water. Perhaps he is negotiating with the fountain. Yeah, we got BBs here.
He's being considerate of it. He's also being a freak. But, you know. Oh no! What are those things? Common egg? Oh my. Alright, I think we're going to go ahead and stop here. We've done quite a lot tonight, and it's getting quite late, plus the stream is going on for three hours, so. Let's go ahead and end there. Alright. Thanks for coming and watching more Chained Echoes. Uh, I hope that you had fun. Um, we got a bit further in the game today, and, uh, and killed quite a lot of guys. Cursed at some ovens. You know, the usual. Um, so, I did want to talk about the fact that I put up a new video today, but it would appear that, um, it would appear that the, uh, creator of that game... Um, in the time that I have been streaming has become quite the problematic individual who committed domestic violence. So not only will I not be talking about that video, I will actually be taking it down after this stream ends. Um, and we will not be playing High on Life anymore on my channel. I will probably finish it off stream. Um, so thank you guys so much for coming. I apologize for that. I will try and upload another video tomorrow maybe. Um, or this weekend. We got a lot that's going on, so uh, whenever I get to it, we'll see. Um, but in better news, tomorrow is Fetish Friday, and you should totally come out and support that. We're going to be doing it on Joystick. Um, I hope that you all, uh, I hope that you will all consider attending. Alright, um, I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, subbies.